हेलो एंड वेलकम टू माय यूट्यूब चैनल वर्ड टू ए एंड टू बी सिमुलेशन एग्जाम सो इफ़ यू वांट टू कंप्लीट असाइनमेंट और एग्जाम यू कैन कॉन्टैक्ट ऑन माय व्हाट्सएप लिंक एंड ईमेल इफ यू वांट टू कंप्लीट मेटल एप कोर्सेज मैकोड सॉफ्ट एक्सेल मैकोड सॉफ्ट वर्ड मैकोड सॉफ्ट पावर पॉइंट एंड मैकोड सॉफ्ट एक्सेस वी कैन डू ऑनलाइन कोर्सेज अकाउंटिंग मैथ स्टैट फाइनानस इकोनॉमिक्स राइटिंग एंड अदर कोर्सेज सो वर्ड टू ए टू बी सम्बलेशन एग्जाम गो गो टू द लॉन्च So open the two A word two A and two B simulation exam. And total question is twenty and attempt remaining is three. So first question is the insert the two column six row table into the documents. So go to the insert tabs and go to the table groups. Click the tables. Is the two column. टू कॉलम सिक्स रो टू बाय टू बाय सिक्स क्लिक ओके सो इन सर्ट द टेबल वी कैन मूव टू द क्वेश्चन नंबर टू सो क्वेश्चन नंबर टू इज इन द फर्स्ट सेल ऑफ द फर्स्ट रो टाइप द कैरियर ऑब्जेक्टिव एंड प्रेस डाउन एर सो Type the carrier type the carrier objective and press the down arrows and next step is in the first cell of the second row type the clinically experience and then press the टैब सो टाइप द क्लिनिकली टाइप द क्लिनिकली एक्सपीरियंस एंड प्रेस टैब सो क्वेश्चन नंबर टू इज अ कंप्लीट वी कैन मूव टू द क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री सो क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री ये क्लिक द क्लिक टू द प्लेस द इंसर्शन पॉइंट इन द सेकंड सेल इन द सेकंड कॉलम एंड देन इंसर्ट द टेक्स्ट इज टू फाइव टू ए जॉब्स इज द डॉक्यूमेंट फोल्डर सो क्लिक द प्लेस इज द सेकंड सेल इन द सेकंड कॉलम सो सेलेक्ट द सेकंड सेल इन द सेकंड कॉलम and then insert the text from the file is to a job in the document folder so insert the text file is to a jobs go to the insert tabs and go to the text groups and click the object is to the text from a files click okay and insert the text is to the text file is to a job is the documents and click the insert and press a backspace one time to remove the blank line at the end of the inserted text so press button is the backspace so question number 3 is the complete we can move to the question number 4 so question number 4 is the in the second row of the table format the paragraph beginning with the text mo monitors and treats and the ending of the text and session promoting we wellness is the bulleted list with the default down bullets is the second row of the tables go to the second row of the second row of the table format the type is the beginning of the monitors go to the monitors text and treat and the end of the text is the promoting wellness and select the 
monitor and treat and end of paragraph is the promoting wellness promoting wellness and to the billet list and with the default round billets go to the home tabs and go to the billets paragraph group and click the billet is the round bullet list is the default the round billets so question number four is complete <coughs> We can move to the question number five. So, question number five is a display the layout tabs and click in the first cell of the tables and then click the drag the right boundary of the first column two inches marks on the horizontally ruler. Display the layout tabs, go to the layout tabs and in the click the first cell of the table. In the first cell of the tables first cell of the table and then click and drag the right boundary of the first column is two inches is the horizontally ruler so select the line move and drag the two inches and next step is using the Table column width box adjust the width of the first column to 1.75. Using the table column width box adjust the width is the first column. First column is the 1.75. So go to the cell size groups and column width is the table column table column with this to 1.75 so type the 1.75 and press enter and next step is the last step is outfit the table to the window go to the layout tabs and go to the cell size groups and click the outfit is to the outfit table to the window click the outfit window so question number five is a complete and we move to the question number six by using the one click row column insertion at the new row above the row is the clinical experience using the one click row and column click the second column is the sorry first column is the clinically experience and add the new row above to the row containing the clinically experience so go to the layout tabs and insert the new row above above row go to the above row insert the new row is the above row is the clinical experience so question number six is complete we move to the question number seven so question number seven is a add a row above the first row of the table add a row above the first row of the table and insert the new row is the insert the above row and merge all cell in the first row of the table in the merge all the cells first row of the tables so select the first row and merge all cell is the first row of the tables so go to the layout tabs and go to the row and column groups sorry go to the merge groups and click the merge cell so question number seven is a complete we can move to the question number eight so a question number eight is the in the third line of the my cell in the first row and set the right steps at the 5.5 .5, 
inches marks on the horizontal rulers. In the third lines, third line, my set is the first row and right tab is the 5.5 .5 inches is the horizontal rulers. In the third line of the my cell in the first row, so select the first row, my cell is the first row, and right tab, right tab 5.5 .5 inches marks on the horizontal rulers. So go to the home tabs and go to the paragraph groups. On the line my cell is the right tabs is the so select the first row in the third line is the first row set the so go to the step number nine is the in the first row of the table and select the Surface the run and apply the bold formatting to the select text and change the font size to the 6 GPT. So select the first row and apply the bolds. Go to the home tabs and go to the font groups and click the bold and formatting to the formatting to the selected text. And change the font size is to the 16 pt. So go to the font size and font size is to the 16 pt. And next is the in the first line of the text, in the first row, change the spacing after 6 pt. Line is the first row and after the 6 pt, go to the layout tabs and after the spacing is to the 6 pt so question number 9 is a complete we can move to the question number 10 so question number 10 is a remove all border from the tables go to the home tabs and go to the paragraph group and click the border is a no border So the remove the all butter from the tables. Go to the go to the table design tabs. Go to the layout tabs and go to the tables and click the select the tables and remove all butter from the tables. So go to the table design tabs and go to the border groups and click the border and click the no border so next step is the with the entire table selected it and apply the box border to the table using the double line style is the seven styles go to the go to the borders and go to the border and shading tabs is the opens is the dialog box and is table selected it's and apply the box go to click the box and table using the double line style is the seven styles two three four five six is the double line styles and click ok so question number 10 is a complete we can move to the question number 11 so question number 11 is a in the first row of the table click the anywhere is the sara r and from the layout tabs and add the ATPT spacing B4s 
click the anywhere and go to the layout tabs go to the layout tab and and from the layout tab and before spacing is the 18 pts so after and before sorry go to the layout tabs and go to the paragraph groups is the before is to ATPT spacings mm. go to the before is the scroll down 6 and ATPT so question number 11 is a complete so if you want to complete assignment or exam you can contact on my whatsapp link and email